So ILD is interstitial lung disease or pulmonary fibrosis is actually one of the most severe um, presentation or part of myositis. Um, I often say that my patients uh, don't die of muscle or skin disease, they die of ILD or lung disease. So it's very, very important. Um, and overall, if you take all comers, about 30 to 40% of all myositis, including dermatomyositis, have ILD. So it's a sizable population, 30 to 40%. Now, there are the fortunately, certain antibodies put you at a high risk for interstitial lung disease or ILD, and certain antibodies put you at a low risk. So the, with the help of myositis-specific antibodies, we can figure out, are you in a high-risk category or low-risk category? In high-risk categories, such as antisynthesis syndrome, ILD can be as frequent as 70 to 80%. In a low risk category, it could be 5 to 10 percent. So it makes a huge difference in our understanding. But if we take all comers, about 30 to 40 percent. So all myositis patients should be evaluated for interstitial lung disease or pulmonary fibrosis.